Anyone who's locked their keys inside their car should remember this brilliant trick. Getting locked out of your car is really annoying. Either you have to go digging for a spare key, call a locksmith, which takes time and costs money, or worse, you have to break into your own car. Who needs that kind of headache? Luckily though, there's one deceptively clever way of unlocking your own car that takes seconds. All you need is a tennis ball and a little bit of elbow grease. If it sounds too good to be true, then you definitely need to watch on. Let's face it, as much as we may need them, there can be a lot of challenges involved with driving, owning, and maintaining a vehicle. There's so much involved that they can seem like they're more trouble than they're worth. Besides the host of other challenges that cars present, one that's often a big problem for even some of the most experienced drivers is remembering to take their keys with them every time they need to go out. Needless to say, without your keys, you're going to have a hard time getting to work, home, or anywhere else you need to go. What adds insult to injury, though, is when you accidentally leave your keys locked inside your own car. There's a way out of this common problem, but it might take some planning ahead of time. Don't wait for an emergency, though. If you're afraid of being locked out of your car, which can happen to anyone, take the proper precautions. With that in mind, let's say you're standing at your locked car when you remember that you left your keys inside. Uh-oh, what on earth are you supposed to do now? <laughs> Don't panic, because there's a solution, and it doesn't involve breaking the window. This might sound strange, but in order to complete this hack, you'll want to have an ordinary tennis ball handy. First, cut or burn a small hole on the surface of the ball. Try not to make it any larger or smaller than the one that's shown here. Next, as you're holding the ball with your thumb and index fingers, place the newly created hole over the car's lock. It's really imperative that you've placed the ball perfectly because otherwise this trick won't work. Finally, push as hard as you possibly can on the tennis ball, directing pressure into the car's lock. If it doesn't work immediately, try readjusting the placement of the tennis ball. It needs to be lined up perfectly in order to work. If you've applied this method correctly, what will happen next will be almost too crazy to believe. You're definitely not going to want to miss seeing this method in action. Once you do, you're going to want to make sure that you have some tennis balls. It's important to remember, of course, that as useful as this trick could be, one should only use this power for good. If you try to apply this method to breaking into someone else's car, you could have a much bigger problem on your hands than just being locked out. You may have always thought the old tennis ball car door trick was a myth, but this should prove otherwise. This could be quite useful when you need it most. Share this awesome tip with friends below.